that Maya album. The Maya album is on point. TKO, the knockout. And that's exactly what she is. It's a knockout. What's up, Golden Eagle? I'm telling you. Uh, the knockout, remember she put out in 2016 that Smooth Jones that got nominated for a Grammy? I didn't even know the album was out until it got nominated for a Grammy. But that was smooth. It was not decent, but this album is the best she's ever done. Yeah. Shoot. I mean, Maya's album, she did, uh, she's got her own label. She's putting out her own music. Uh, she got Planet Nine. But this album here is, is sensual. You know, like, You Got Me is my favorite song on the album. You know, so. She, she released the Ready For Whatever and Ready Part 2 and all that stuff, but. And damage and you got me on my like the songs that first stood out for me. But then simple things like the simple things in life, you know, it's a this is more an adult album. You know, and it was really good to see her at this level. Cause she's not the little twenty some year old girl you know from before. I didn't hear Cisco on there. Is Cisco on the album? I didn't hear Cisco. Um, is he singing on with you or something? Knock you out, I remember that. And you no know, open. Open is dope, but that's a rap on there named Gold Link. Oh, that's what I'm gonna say. He's not on the knockout. But I mean, some of the songs I got, some of the songs sound like they were recorded, and uh, somebody didn't even mix them down or send them in for mastering. The audio is so off on some of those like earlier. You could tell they recorded at different times in different places. Cause I'm like, wait, how did this even make an album? It's not even done. Like they need to get in there and get some of the trouble out this song. Something's going off. The engineer was asleep. They need to get in there and get this thing synced up right. But some of the songs are more professional, like they mixed them down. The rest were not. I'm like, whoa, wait a minute. So this was going back to the classical, traditional R&B type of music. Instead of more party-ish, this was more grown-up, more seductive. And I like that. So definitely go get it. I, out of four stars, I give it three. It's amazing work. And, but her best album to date. Without, get the knockout. I, I guarantee you, you won't be disappointed.